Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to discuss the another Python project, which is uh, LSB steganography along with the cryptographic algorithm called AES. So as far as the data security is concerned or the information security is concerned, there are majorly two approaches are used to protect the data or the information from getting hacked or from getting still so one is the cryptographic algorithm so under that we convert data into some another format called ciphertext and then that ciphertext is sent and the person who is having the key to decode it only that person can decode that information but the problem with this cryptographic algorithm is that uh, even if you send data in the cryptographic form or in, in the form of ciphertext any person can take doubt on it and he can apply permutations and combinations to extract or decode that information even in modern days uh, we are having decode computers who uh, randomly tries to decode that information so because of that it is possible to decode the data secured by the cryptographic algorithms Till that we consider AES algorithm that is advanced, advanced encryption standard algorithm to be the best algorithm for uh, data security using cryptographic algorithms. There is another approach where it is very much difficult to hack the information or to retrieve the information by any third person is steganography. Now what happens in the steganography? Here we do not convert uh, the message into some ciphertext. Instead, we hide that particular uh, message into some image or some audio or some video. So in this particular project, we are going to hide the data in two separate images. And then that is going to uh, make it more difficult to hide the message or to decode the message. Now here we will be what we are going to do our approach will be we will be uh, having a secret message then that message is converted to some ciphertext using cryptography algorithm so we are using cryptography plus steganography hybrid approach now first of all the cryptography will happen on that particular message so that message will be converted to some ciphertext and then we will divide that ciphertext into two halves so first half of that ciphertext will go in some another image and the other half will go in some other image so this way we are actually sending message in two different images so even if one of the image is trapped and it is uh, decoded then also the third person will get only the half of the message not the complete message so that way we are increasing the security now this is the uh, paper in which uh, we are discussing the how this can be happening so in this paper only one image is used but in our actual project we'll be using two different images to hide the message using the uh, steganography plus cryptography algorithm now coming back to the implementation part so here this is the coding part we are using flask framework to build the web application and uh, the, uh, so that the GUI will be a web-based GUI and uh, some Python codes and some HTML and CSS code stored in the templates and the static folder. Now once this is running, we will be going on the web browser and we will type in localhost colon 5000. Then the first page that is login page will open. So here the user will have to log in. So admin admin is the username and password and this encode and decode password. The user can set any password of his choice and he can use so for example now right now i'm using admin as encode decode password so this particular password will be used to encode and decode the information then we will log in so after login so this kind of approach we are going to follow the secret information is there that is converted to ciphertext then there will be a cover image so then this is LSB encoding. So this is going to happen using AES cryptography and this is steganography and reverse steganography that is steganalysis. Now the next important page is steganography. So here we will have to choose two different images. Now for example, let's uh, uh, we will be uh, picking up some images. Now let's go here and uh, from the static folder, if I can get some, okay. So I will be taking this image, then another image let's say uh, we'll pick this image only okay so these two images then upload 
now these two images are uploaded over here now here I can type some uh, secret message so I will type my uh, message this is my secret message for example so once I click on hide what happens here this my message is now converted to this and this is happening due to the AES cryptography this is the first part of our project now we have converted our message to this one so half of this message this half of this message this cryptographic message still this is not readable my message is converted to this one again we are increasing the security this half message we are hiding here using the LSB steganography algorithm and the remaining half of this message is hidden in this particular image and these are the images called as stego images in which the message is hidden now if you consider these two images and if you compare with these original images you will find that both the images are looking exactly same there is no visual differences between the original images and the stego images so whenever you will send these images the uh, third person will not take any doubt on these images for example the message will be there in this particular image or some secret communication is happening through this so third person will not be able to take any kind of doubt so he will not be decoding such messages. so that way we are securing our data but if you send only this as a message then and as if somebody catches that particular message in between he will definitely get and doubt key some sort of secret communication is happening through this and then he can apply permutations and combinations and decode computers can decode this message into my message now this is first half of this particular project where we are hiding the message the next is stig analysis so in the stig analysis we have received these two stego images now we want to decode it now once I click on decode I will get back original message so this is my original message after decoding so in the decoding reverse procedure happens first of all it will take half ciphertext from this image then another half from this image then it will combine both the ciphertext together to form a complete ciphertext and then uh, reverse uh, cryptography or reverse AES algorithm will be applied so that we will be getting the original message back so this kind of communication or the security can be used uh, in the military applications or for the defense industry where the uh, information security is very much critical or in some other sectors like banking sectors to protect the passwords and other stuff this kind of security mechanism can be used so this is all about the implementation of this project in case you need the complete documentation report PPDs and code and its uh, explanation of that particular code then you can check out the description box under this video thank you